a family that prays together stays together. My name is Taiba Deus, a seminarian of the Congregation of Holy Cross. Welcome to day six of prayer and reflection on a journey of the seven days with Our Lady of Solos in preparation for the Feast of Our Lady of Solos on 15th September 2023. The sixth solo, Jesus is taken from the cross. This is found in the Gospel of John chapter 19 verses 39 to 40. Mary's presence and seeing her dear son hanging on the cross being pierced was such a terrible experience of suffering any mother could endure. But more painful was holding the lifeless body of her son. Mary's journey with the son up to this point shows her love and support she offered to her son in hard times so that he can fulfill God's mission for our salvation. Christ giving up his body to the tormentors reflects the deep love and mercy that the Father had loved humanity. This should always remind us the mystery of the Eucharist where Christ offers himself in a sacrifice of the body and blood on the cross for our redemption. Therefore, our participation in the Holy Eucharist as we receive the body and blood of Christ during Holy Communion should remind us of the pains that Mary endured holding the lifeless body of her son in, in her venerable hands due to the sins of humanity. It should call us to repentance so that we can receive him with worthy hearts. We should also look at Mary as mother who supports us, holds us whenever we are faced with challenging situations and during moments of our suffering. Let us pray. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death, Amen. Mary, Queen of Families, pray for us. Mm -hmm.